Google Assistant, the new intelligent conversational virtual assistant, was only officially available for the new Pixel phones, but not anymore. Now you can officially get Google Assistant on your Android devices running Android Marshmallow or Nougat. And that's exactly what I'm going to show you guys in this video. Excited? So let's get started. There are lots of tutorials available on YouTube regarding Google Assistant, but in most of the tutorial, you have to be rooted. But now Google has officially released the Google Assistant update for Android Marshmallow and Nougat, but the sad thing is that it is only available for some specific regions. So if you guys are impatient as me to get the Google Assistant on your devices, then do watch this video till the end and make sure to follow the steps properly. With that being said, let's head over to the browser. From here, you have to search for Google Play Services Beta and open this APK Mirror link. Make sure the version should be 10.2.98 or higher. Now from here, download the APK file and install it. Make sure your unknown sources is enabled, otherwise you won't be able to install the APK file. Now open Play Store and type Google and open the official Google app. Now scroll down at the end, here you will find an option to become a beta tester. So click I am in and wait for a few minutes till you get the approval. Once that is done, you will find the latest beta version, so just update it. Once both the apps are installed, go to the setting menu, then scroll down to find language and inputs option and open that. Now click on languages, here you have to select English US as your primary language and if you have any other language assigned, then just remove it. Now you are almost done. After setting US English as default language, go back to the setting menu and find app section and open it. Now from here, you have to find Google Apps and open it. Now go to storage, then manage space and from here, you have to clear all data and cache. The same thing you have to do with the Google Play services. Once that is done, go back to home screen and clear all apps from the recent window and make sure no app is running in the background. Now all you need to do is to simply tap and hold the home button of your Android smartphone. Doing so will show you a pop-up asking you to get started with Google Assistant on your Android smartphone. So now you can just tap the home button to ask Google Assistant for the nearest coffee shop. It can read your recent text message and also tell you the weather. If you are getting bored, it can also play music for you. In many aspects, it is like Google Now, but currently it's low on feature and function, but I think there are lots of features which will be added in future. So guys, this was just a quick video to show you how you can get Google Assistant on your Android devices. If you find this video useful, then do appreciate my content by subscribing to my channel. And I will see you guys in my next one.